Welcome back to Frozen Ropes Tip of the Week. We're here with Coach Brandon Decker. He's one of our most popular coaches. Played a few seasons under Coach Tony Gwynn at San Diego State. Now we're getting a little close to Christmas and getting close to Little League season. And Coach Decker's here today to tell us how to properly execute soft toss, which is one of the most important drills while you're getting your Little League player ready to go. Coach, what do you got for us? Well, let's go. Let's get right into it. Hey, how we doing guys? Alright, so we're going to talk about today the setup and the proper way to do soft tops. Obviously there's a couple ways when you're out on the field, on the cement, or on a hard surface. Some coaches prefer other ways than doing it the other way. The first one we're going to go with is your basic one knee drill when you're tossing from the knee. This is a basic start point right here where you want to be a good enough distance away from home plate. You want to be a little bit out in front of home plate so you can get a little bit of a forward motion going towards the batter. You never want to be to the side or behind the batter because it's a lot harder to judge the flight of the ball and take a good proper swing from the batter's box if you're directly in the middle of the player or behind the player. So you always want to angle yourself a little bit in front of home plate. A good way to start is always showing the ball to the hitter before they're ready to swing. You go from the hitter, you drop down, and you give them a nice easy soft toss so they can get their timing and everything else right. Same thing you can do if you're out on the cement, you're on a harder surface, a bucket is always a good way to go. You have an empty bucket, you turn it over, same way. Show your player the ball, give them a nice easy underhand, feed it right to them, let them swing, and we'll go from there. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to show you how to do it with a hitter in the box. Now after we showed you the basic setups, here's what it looks like with the player in the box. Thanks Coach Decker. That's how you properly perform soft toss. Tune in next week with our next tip of the week. And while you're at it, follow us on Facebook at SD Frozen Ropes. Visit our website, Frozen Ropes San Diego. Make sure you follow us on Twitter at SD Frozen Ropes. Thank you from our staff here at Frozen Ropes, where there's never an off season.